In this reaction, we have HNO3 plus CaCO3 coming together in a chemical reaction. Let's balance that. We have one hydrogen, we have one nitrogen, three oxygens, plus these three oxygens right here. So we have six total oxygens, one calcium, and then one carbon. Over on the product side, we have the two hydrogens. We have two times the one. This two applies to everything. So two times one, two nitrogens. Oxygens, we have one with the water, plus two in that CO2, plus two times three, six. So we have one, three, plus six is nine oxygen atoms. We have one calcium and then one carbon. When we look at it, let's leave the oxygens till last and let's fix the nitrogens. So we have one here and then two here. If we put a two in front of the HNO3, that should fix the nitrogens. This two applies to everything, so we'll need to update some numbers here. So we have one times two, so that gives us two hydrogens, one times two, two nitrogens, and then for oxygens, three times two is six, plus the three right here, that gives us nine of those oxygens. And as we look at these numbers, everything is the same. That means this equation is balanced. So everything looks good. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for HNO3 plus CaCO3. And thanks for watching.